Good morning, welcome to the forecast discussion for Friday, August 11th, 2017. Well, we're going to have a wet end to the week and for the start of this weekend, but some improving weather conditions by the time we get to Sunday afternoon. At least it won't be a complete washout, but certainly will be cool out there with temperatures continuing to remain below normal for this time of year. Temperatures this morning range from the upper 60s to lower 70s over the interior, lower to mid 70s along the coast with an increase in cloud cover and also humidity. Winds are coming in from the south and southeast at around 5 to 15 miles per hour, and those winds will continue to back towards the east as we move on through the day as a warm front approaches the region. Radar right now does show a few isolated showers out there, but nothing really reaching the ground. We will see an increase in shower potential as we move on through the afternoon, becoming more widespread as we head towards this evening and overnight tonight. Now, the reason why we're having this setup is because this frontal boundary right here is going to be lifting northward as a warm front, and this cold front here is going to be moving to the east coast. The combination of the two is basically a squeeze play over the region, leading to the potential for showers throughout the area. Winds ahead of this warm front will be from the east around 5 to 15 miles per hour. Then as this warm front is lifting northward and this cold front is approaching from the east, tomorrow we'll see winds swing around to the southwest and then quickly to the northwest by tomorrow evening as the cold front moves through. While this is happening, periods of rain, heavy at times, can be expected. Now, this won't be an all-day heavy rain event, but if you do get in between some breaks of these heavy rainfall uh, areas, you will still have overcast cloud cover and some areas of drizzle. So again, not exactly the best beach day or any type of outdoor activity conditions. So it's just going to be one of those weekends. But the good news is that the cold front will be pushing off the coast on Sunday morning. So we do have a few lingering showers followed by clearing skies by the time we get to the afternoon hours. I can't rely on an isolated shower or two because the cold front stalls off the coast. But overall... By the time we get to Sunday afternoon, if you have plans for Sunday afternoon, well, that should be a little bit better. But still a bit cool out there with temperatures in the upper 70s to lower 80s. So for today, we'll see an increase in cloud cover, showers developing towards the evening. The rainfall may be heavy at times, especially as you head towards the evening hours. High temperatures today range from the mid-70s along the coast and upper 70s to lower 80s in the Delaware River Valley. For tonight, look for periods of rain becoming more widespread as you head towards the morning hours, lows in the mid to upper 60s. For tomorrow afternoon, scattered showers, possibly a few embedded thunderstorms, some heavy downpours, and not the best conditions for outdoor uh, plans. Temperatures will rise into the mid to upper 70s along the coast and upper 70s to lower 80s in the Delaware River Valley. On Sunday, the cold front will push off the coast but will remain close enough to keep a threat for a few isolated showers in place. Look for lows in the mid to upper 60s, highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s. On Monday, an area of low pressure will approach the region with the potential for some periods of rain Monday afternoon on through Tuesday morning. Look for temperatures to range from the lower to mid 60s for lows and mid 70s along the coast and upper 70s to lower 80s in the Delaware River Valley. On Tuesday, a few isolated showers may linger in the morning hours followed by clearing skies in the afternoon. Look for lows in the mid-60s, highs in the mid to upper 70s. On Wednesday, high pressure will be in place with sky cloud cover. Lows in the lower to mid-60s, highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s. On Thursday, high pressure again in place. A weak cold front will drop in from the north, possibly producing a few isolated showers in the late evening hours. Look for lows in the mid to upper 60s, highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s. And on Friday, a cold front will linger over the region with the threat for a few isolated to widely scattered showers. Look for lows in the mid to upper 60s, highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s. That is your forecast discussion for today. Thank you for following NYNJPA weather. Have a great day and stay safe out there.